So it didn't take me long to realize that when traveling overseas, your sand wedge is only good for hacking it out of the fescue or out of a pot bunker. Lots of times I see some of our other travelers trying to use their sand wedge in a lot of situations when they shouldn't. The fairways are generally so tight on Lynx Golf that you're better off using your hybrid fairway wood to try to accomplish a bump and run shot, keeping the ball running along the ground rather than trying to loft it up in the air. So to accomplish this shot, what I like to do first, I've got my three fairway wood here. I don't have a hybrid. What I like to do is choke down for a little bit more control. I'm gonna move the ball slightly forward in my stance and I'm gonna try and make a motion here with a little bit of weight on my left side where I am just moving my arms back and through. It's really a big putting motion. It takes a little bit of time to develop some feel, but I promise you that if you continue to try and incorporate this shot into your repertoire, you can become pretty good at it. So I'm gonna take into account for the break here because this ball is gonna stay on the green for the majority of the shot. I'm gonna aim out to the left and making my big putting motion with my hybrid run the ball along the ground. So remember, when you find yourself on a tight lie in Lynx Golf, abandon the sand wedge or lob wedge and use your hybrid or fairway wood to get the ball closer. Try and use the same length motion you would for a putter from the same distance.